Yo, 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 big aloha and welcome to Real Talk Hip Hop Hawaii. I'm your host, Josh Sun, and we're coming to you from Inside Out Universe Studios in Haiku, Maui. We got a very, very special guest for you today. We got the one and only Pure Powers up in the building. Oh, what's up, Maui? What How up, doing? dog? Chilling. Chilling. How you doing? Oh, I'm living. I'm good. That's what's up, yeah, man. Life, That's what's up. Life is great, man. It's really definitely is. an honor and a pleasure to have you here. You've been doing some big things, and we're really proud of you. And, you know, it's good to cool. see uh kihei boy representing yeah. on the mainland and so doing your so thing you. and going on tour and doing all that man it's really, it's really inspiring and we're really proud of you man. Right. Well, it's great to be here man uh you know we go way back you know and it, it's great to to really get reconnected with <clears throat> my maui ohana and and uh and be out here and get rooted and just kind of recharge my battery get my mana you know going and uh really that's that's what it's about and really just like bridging this, this gap between the mainland and here and, and really just uh, showing cats in the mainland how we do in Hawaii and showing cats in Hawaii how, how the fam out, out there are representing and bringing Definitely. good music and hip-hop and culture to the Aina. Yeah, yeah, that's what's up, man. Mm -hmm. So, like, I guess let's start at the beginning. How long have you been rapping? Um, a while. Yeah, uh, yeah I, I think it was, like, eighth grade. Nice. I started, uh, started thinking about it and, you know, and saw a couple homies doing it. Uh, before I moved to Maui, before I was transplanted in Kihei in high school, I was uh, I was raised in Sonoma County, the North Bay area, uh, 707. And um, <clears throat> so there was like a lot of uh, Bay Area gangster rap, you know, was was going on. And I wasn't really even sure if like white kids, I was out in the cuts, you know, mm -hmm. out in wine country and stuff. I wasn't even sure if we were like even like allowed to. And I saw... Um, my, my older cousin, uh, or my big homie Dave Dublin, was busting, and this other white dude, and people were like really into that, and, and uh, it just really inspired me, and I started rapping, and uh, and then like Eminem came out, you know, shortly after that, and um, mm -hmm. it's all, all sorts of. I mean, there's been other cats. Ari the Rugged Man's been doing it forever, you know. There's a uh, MC Search, you know. There's all yeah, sorts yeah. of cats, you know. Beastie Boys were kind of like, well, they're like just Beastie Boys. Vanilla Ice kind of like gave us a bad look for a while, but yeah, for sure. I don't know. And it's it's been really cool. And, you know, I, I grew up yeah. and and now to be on tour with cats I've been listening to forever. You know, Souls of Mischief and and Dell. I think both sides of the brain was the first album that really resonated with me with Dell. Yeah, I love that album. So good. Yeah, so it feels good to be out here with with guys I've always looked up to and and to have them be a part of the family now, or, or for me to be a part of their family now. It's Guaranteed. feels really good, you know. You want us to tell us a little bit about the background of your name, how you got your name, Pure Powers? Pure Powers. Well, <clears throat> my uh, my government name, my Babylon name, is Brendan Powers. Babylon. So my last name is Powers. Right, and right. Uh, Pure was like, man, <clears throat> Pure, my sister used to actually, she, you know, shouts out to my sister, you know, I love my older sister. She, uh, she kind of started getting me into like some hip hop. Um, that actually Dublin was, I think, getting her into a little bit, and mm -hmm. and she was showing me cats like <clears throat> Project Bloat and and uh, this maybe off topic, but like you know Atmosphere, and this is back in the day, you know, like Living Legends and, and Hieroglyphics and yeah, stuff yeah. like that, and Quantum Records and definitely, all those definitely. cats, and so she also she used to buy me, I used to really like Pure Players gear, and it was kind of oh, like yeah, around like that, Fubu yeah. and stuff like yeah, that yeah. was popping, and and I like we get Pure Players, and I had this hat that said pure players on it. And I remember like, like praying on it when I was like 16. I was like, I need a name. And I, was, I first was going to go with Doobie. Um, like girls can do B. I I was rolling like a lot of doobies at the time. I think, you know, I was like 12 or 13. Yeah, yeah. I was like Doobie. Yeah. And then, and then like there's Sugar Wolf Pimp uh, from um, the Cutthroat Committee, Max Ray's friend. Uh, he, he's Doobie. And even though he spelled a different, like, I was I'm a, I'm a big fan of Doobie uh, at least back in the day you know he's he's really uh, dope so you know I had to come up with another name so then I'm sitting there and I was thinking I remember just like meditating on it and I like looked up and the first thing I saw was the pure. pure it was a pure P right there and I was like oh yes I'll just go with that and then you know I got it tattooed on my back when I was like 19 and at that point I was like well there's really no Turning I'm back now. Back. Yeah. Can't change a, it now. Yeah, I'm so deranged. I got my soul engraved on my shoulder blades, so now you know my name. That's what's up. Mm -hmm. Right there. Boom. Yeah. <laughs> so you've been working on some projects. The last album was really awesome. My Thanks. album, yeah. Thank you. The full length. Mm -hmm. I had a really good, a lot of good cameos and appearances, too. From yeah. Some legendary artists. 
Thank you. And then you got some more projects coming up too. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, my album uh, is uh, actually available for free download at the moment at uh, purepowers.bandcamp.com. Yeah, so check, check that out. Check that out. Download it. Share it with your friends. Um, yeah, it's got like Scarab from Living Legends, Kirby Dominant, uh, L.A. Cole, uh, a lot of, you know, the homie Dublin's on there. A, l- a lot of different cats are on there. And, it's a uh, good album. Tantrum, um, a bunch of dudes. And uh, I Am I from Kamehameha Project. So, <clears throat> No Hokai, Kapu, all the fam. So, and then that was kind of like my first uh, project that I'd done officially. I put out like other things, like little burn CDs, mixtapes I'd hustle on, on, on the street or whatever, you know. But this is like my first shrunk rap, like digipacked, you know. Um, to me, it was like a high production uh High production album, you know, and then I, I you hear that, and I hear like little imperfections. My style has definitely changed a lot since then, and um, then I linked up with RG Recordings, um, a record label in Sonoma County, a little independent one. Uh, Rudy G, huge shout outs to RG Recordings. Um, we started linking up on an album called One Dream, nice. and uh, you know it's kind of um, you know it's a you know dream I've been having since back in the day. OD was in there, the Graffiti Crew, uh, you know, was affiliated with when I was younger and kind of uh, brought me up in the, in the hip-hop world when I was real young. And uh, so One Dream, it's got, you know, there's some great features on it. Um, <clears throat> and it really is like showing where I'm at. It's nice to have something that's going to kind of display a little bit of where I'm at, you know, creatively, you yeah. know, because there's a lot of stuff where I can be like, oh, I like this song, I like that song. <laughs> You're going to learn today, man. I should put my phone in silent. But um, so, yeah, that one's going to be cool. We got like, you know, Opio, um, Opio and, and – uh, Pep Love of Hieroglyphics, oh, yeah. uh, production First from, Light. Yeah. yeah, First Light. Shouts out to them, man. Those are the homies. And, and uh, we got Amp Life, um, formerly of Zion Eye, on some production. Um, you know, got, got some more other surprises. You know, some been on tour with Dell. You know, he might make a little guest appearance. Um, <clears throat> a lot of, there's a lot of cool, you know, my homie Landon Wordswell's on there. Uh, oh. Frankie Valentine's making beats. Uh, um, my uh, my niece's uh, husband, Audio, you know, I guess that'd be like, uh, nephew-in-law maybe um he's he's banging out some dope tracks wordsmith's got tracks on there um so boy Fetty murphy aka dirt cobain um a lot of a lot of dope beats on there and dope features and i'm really excited about it we just That's uh we got a single called um your time and it's about just like really believing in yourself and the power of now and and what we can do if we put our minds to it and and you know there ain't nothing to it but to do it and the first thing is to find out what you want to do and have that dream and then just have dogged persistence and due diligence in chasing that you know and don't let anything you know knock you off your path because there's gonna be a lot of things that are gonna try to knock you off your path and um you just gotta you just gotta roll with it and and keep keep going after it and then it's things are starting to pay off you know what i mean And, and you know, the, the fact that, you know, we sold out the Hard Rock show within the first hour, you know, and, and uh, this, this underground Ohana thing, it's, it's really starting to take off. So that's Definitely, that's definitely. Good. Yeah, we can't wait till next year when we have you back. Yeah. You yeah. want to give any shout outs or anything or say anything to people? Yeah, I mean, uh, <clears throat> huge shout outs to Gavin Darrow. Um, when putting together the underground Ohana tour, um, you know, can't wait to, to get back out here. Um, huge shout outs to, you know, A Plus, uh, Scarab. Um, you know, uh, Grouch is out here on, on, on the island. Huge shout outs to, to Grouch. Um, you know, Dell, Domino, uh, Nobody, Nobody in A Plus got an album coming out called Grow Theory. Um, a that's going to be a really too. dope album. Um, huge shout outs to all you guys watching this. Anyone who came out to the shows, my folks in Kia, my folks up country, West Side, Hana Side, you know, Oahu, Big Island folks, um, you know, Molokai, Lanai, Kauai. You know, I love y'all, and um, that's, you know, huge shout-outs to, to everyone who, who's shown support. Um, let's see, sibs.com, um, these dope skateboards. I don't know if y'all see that shit. That's just dope, right? Um, you know, RG Recordings, of course, uh, my label mates, um, you know, Horchata La Chapa, um, uh, Frankie V, uh, Kitty Knight, Vocab Slick, the homie. And there's too many homies to name, you know, yeah, all from yeah. the Internet Projects fam. Uh, Tantra helping us out, Bone on the on the North Shore, Pulse of Power helping put this together. You know, thank you so much. You know, Unsung Mighty Few, all y'all. Uh, let's see, Goyaki. Um, I love Goyaki, and y'all should drink Me it too. too. I'm addicted to that shit. Yeah, <laughs> you get it in. O Snuff for helping out. Um, you know, and that's the whole Hieroglyphics family, um, Living Legends crew, and uh, oh yeah, I also want to give a huge shout out to the whole. Um, 
Team Backpack and Yo Bring It Back Tour, Vans Warped Tour, Wells on Warped. Um, I'm going to be going out there with RG Recordings and the Team Backpack family and uh, the Yo Bring It Back family to uh, raise awareness of the water crisis um, from Flint, Michigan to Uganda, um, other countries that are having a hard time, the places having a hard time getting it, things that we see, you know, as, as just an everyday, uh, you know, it's not a luxury, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And, uh, and so we're just trying to raise some, some money to get wells cracking and, That's what's up. and just bring that supply. Cause it's really not a supply problem. It's a distribution problem. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. And so we're trying to raise awareness going on the whole warp tour. So catch me on that. Uh, it's gonna be a lot of fun. That's about it, man. Um, check out One Dream at rgrecordings.com, uh, Pure Powers, uh, facebook.com, backslash Pure Powers Music. Same thing with SoundCloud, just backslash Pure Powers Music. Um, <clears throat> Instagram, instagram.com, backslash Pure Powers Music. Twitter, et cetera, et cetera. Look out for One Dream. I'm also doing a project called Year of the Peacock that will be out a little bit later. It's on some a little bit more electronic stuff. Got production from uh, A+, Plus, uh, Amp Live, um, we got Scarab on there, Z-Man's on there. Oh, yeah, Z-Man's on One Dream, too. Um, Shouts out to Z-Man and, and the whole, my whole Gurp City fan. Gurp City. It just feels great to be out here, man. And uh, I really look forward to bringing you these next albums. They're going to be available for free download at rgrecordings.com. Watch Your Time. It's going to be on uh, YouTube and Vivo and all that good stuff. My name is Pure Powers. God bless. And a little high. That's what's up. That's what's up, man. Cool. Yeah, look out for this boy. He's on the rise. Yeah. That's it. It's been Real Talk Hip Hop White. I'm your host, Josh Sun. Inside Out Universe Studios. We out here. Boom. Boom.